November 21st, 2003. When his parents left on vacation, Nathan was left with the responsibility of staying home alone. This was until his uncle Eric arrived from the airport. Okay. Okay, it's not, uh, I don't think it's just me. There's no audio. This guy walks extremely quietly. Extremely quietly. Oh God, when was the last time I cleaned the kitchen? I don't know. Damn. Yo, if only dishes were this easy. Okay, there is audio. Who's at the door? Who the hell are you? Hey there, kiddo. How's my favorite nephew doing? Uh, great. How was your day? I was pretty busy at work, but I'm happy to be here now. Okay. I want to take a shower if that's okay. Sounds good. If you need anything, just let me know. You got it. Alright. Like the historically big creep that we are. Let us follow him into the restroom to make sure he's finding everything as it was. Is there not a bathroom? Oh. The moment when you let in some creepy weird uncle that you think is friendly, but turns out to be not friendly. Huh. You need to clean the kitchen again. Yo, I cannot see it all in there. Can't see it here either. Jesus, it's dark. It's a garage. Oh, they got a TV? What the hell? Good evening, I'm Connor Fallon, and tonight we bring you a special report on a concerning development in the Benton neighborhood. All right. According to recent reports, there have been multiple cases of missing persons over the past few weeks, leaving the community in a state of anxiety and uncertainty. One local resident who has been actively involved in addressing this issue is Sarah, oh, my who has tired? been a resident of the Benton community for over two decades. In a recent interview, Sarah expressed her apprehension about the frequency of these disappearances and the need for the community to take proactive measures in addressing the issue. It is alarming to think that individuals can simply oh, vanish fuck. without a trace. This is happening too frequently in our neighborhood, and it is time for us to take this matter seriously. The families of All right, I guess we're going to bed. understandably concerned and worried, Sarah stated. The police have confirmed that they are investigating each case of a missing person, however, as of yet, no leads have been found. Consequently, the Benton Boulevard community remains on high alert, with many taking extra precautions to ensure their safety. I thought I saw something there. This is the dream we just like immediately drop into a dream. <laughs> nice train. Oh shit. Ah! Uncle's flight got delayed. What? What do you mean? Why are you surprised? He is in the house. Don't joke with me. I swear to God, I'm not joking. Where is he right now? Lock yourself. I am getting the gun. How do you know? How do you know to address us as like a nephew then? This is a fucked up situation. Oh. 
my dad put the fucking gun. It's in the drawer. That's a warning shot, bitch. Damn, no more bullets. Are you fucking kidding me? We're <laughs> dead. <laughs> All right, I guess we go downstairs. I don't, I don't know what else we can do. Besides lock ourselves up. Oh my god. He's boarded up the doors. Get the fuck out. We made it. Alright. Not bad. Made by Japan. Beer Creek.